What is up, boys? Just before the Santa. That's not the name in your file, Michael. Steve Haynes here. Yeah, Agent Douchebag. <laughs> hey, that poor some bitch we grant for you still breathing? See for yourself right now. Oh, Trevor fuck. Films is on his way to help with the debrief. Oh, great. Off Dutch London and Banning. Great. Sounds just like my kind of party. Okay, we got a mission to go to. Go to the warehouse. Let's get over there, boys. I want to say thank you for all the love and support on the previous episodes, and without further ado, let's get over there. It isn't that far, to be fair. It's a little bit far, but we'll just get there. Wait, we can go as Trevor right now. Yeah, why not then? Why not? Set to swap. Why not? Let's mix it up. Is Trevor already there? I figured it might be a bit quicker if we just go as Trevor. What? <laughs> Oh, oh man. Oh, nothing. Are you taking a dump? Oh, why do you care, huh? The fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> uh, I got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know. Nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. Did you see his face that last time I popped it. <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. He reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> yeah, hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> and a tail catcher. <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> you, where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Oh man, I remember this mission. No, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay. I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, high fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. You know? You're a so. fucking spy. <laughs> <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. So I need to know. What did you tell them, and what did they tell you? Oh boy. I told, hmm? them, I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? I. Hey. This whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm tired of these fucking nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. All right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. Wait, wait. No. You get to work, and uh, I'm not here. Okay. The guy's your neighbor. Caesar's place, Rockford Hills. Well, let's get going then. Man, they get Trevor to fucking. Trevor's like that's that's what he does, bro. Like he, he's that's easy he's, he's place, bro. You know that's that's what he yeah, does. The more I see of your boss, the more I like you. If I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who other associate. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit, and that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, hmm. well, boo -hoo 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 for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control Los the Santos reboot and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. <laughs> anyway, 
Any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What okay. does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job. Oh, shit. Brad went down, you went down. Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Mm. This is bullshit. This place? Davy, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. <laughs> Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Oh boy. This is gonna get that guy hurt, man. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't want to silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Okay. Hey, you want a coffee? Some water. Turns oh, out man. that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Oh, Where do man. we start, eh, buddy? <clears throat> uh, wait. What are you talking about, the wrong guy? No. Who do you want? Just tell me what you want, huh, man? Oh, uh, please. Boy. Look at me, please. Um. Let's go with the wrench. You barely feel a thing. I will. I will. Yeah, no, you will. No. I feel bad about doing this, man. I didn't get a lot. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tay here. Javan. Why didn't you ask me? I know Tay here. Uh, I did his home, home theater. He lives in Chumash, the right. Into the Western Highway. Oh, that wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. Okay. <clears throat> Coffee breaks over. Chumash, you're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's get going then. Go to Chumash. Gotcha. This episode's been really good so far. Alrighty. Off we go. To Chumash. So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we tried to take full advantage of you. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job. No casualties. There were more eyes on the town than we Yeah, well, according to my eyes, that is your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad. Who oh, he man. thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainee's mm -hmm. right. It's a good exercise. Okay. This'll do. Alright. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need the description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. Oh, no, no, please. I tell what? you what you Loosen want to do. Loosen him know. up! No. Please. Oh, again? The fuck? Um. I'm gonna this. level with ya. This'll hurt. <laughs> Not that! No, come on, please! Don't do it! Oh, I don't want him, man. You can't! Oh. Please! 
Okay, let's see. We're live. You see anyone down there who might be in Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? You might be in Azerbaijan for all I know. <laughs> What's one look like? They look eastern. Half this town looks eastern, Davy. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. Okay, back to Trevor. That ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit, I, 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 let me think, I... <laughs> Sorry, too late, Trevor! Show our contestant what he's won today. Um... Tell me where to start. Hey, are any of those teeth less useful than the others? Are they still alive? <laughs> I won't worry about that, brother. Oh, man. And it comes. Oh, man. Oh, he was a tough SOB, that little guy. Shit! That hurts so hard! So, what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, no. No, 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 He's got beard. He's got beard. Uh huh. I think you're making this up. No, no, I'm not. No. Yeah. I'm telling the truth. Bushy beard? Got any beardy types at this party? Huh? Because that's all Mr. K's given us. No. You know, I'm thinking maybe we ought to just take two bullets and put them in our uniform and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. We're back in. Give me some eyes. Okay. Who am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? There's Anything a beard specific there. Or is a beard some there. stubble gonna cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Ah, there's a First few beards at this beards party. Beards all over this place. Pinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. Beards are in fashion in Jumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. Uh, Alright, we go again. A long day until you give us some intel on our target. Oh, he's, he's got beard. His folks. He looks like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time? Just to be sure. No, please, no. Uh -huh. I told you, he smokes. That's all I know. Okay. Um. Where you want it? Nowhere. <laughs> please. Please. Isn't there a small one? No, no there's no. That's what happens when you put the body through the ringer. Oh shit. In his heart? <gasps> Fucking hell, bro. How long was that out? Jesus. That's rough, man. <laughs> Mr. K. <laughs> Mr. K. I don't know anything, you please. Okay. He chain smokes. And he's left handed. What's that? He chain smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. Any these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Okay. Steve's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. Ah. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. There we go. And he's left-handed. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left-handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest's details. That's right hand, bro. It's this guy. Ah, I see someone. 
He fits the profile. Yep, fits it all the way. I got a good feeling. Well, as good as you can get while clipping a guy who probably don't deserve it. Now I'm taking the shot. Maybe I got someone. Definitely a lefty. Redwood smoking, bearded, maybe. Could be. Used to be, Azerbaijani. Good enough for me. Steve, it's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work to the pair of you. Now, I got a rapid ball game to get to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the <coughs> fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. <coughs> oh, man. I wanted to kill him? Fuck. Oh, come on. Wait a second, me too. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. What? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. Well. <coughs> oh, <for> fuck's sakes. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Just beat the shit out of him, bro. Right. He's like, oh, you're yeah, hurt. <laughs> okay. Let's get you to the air. Well. <laughs> he's just beating the shit out of him and he's worried about safety. Oh man. Okay. On we go. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you gonna hold it together? I don't want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home! I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message! <laughs> you're a torture advocate! Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We needed to get information to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer. Or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's <laughs> useless as a means of getting information. Departures. No one drives me to the airport. <laughs> At least you've done the right thing. I did kill him. <clears throat> Run! You're free! Oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, alright? And look, trust no one, alright? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. Damn, bro. Well, that was rough. That was rough. Poor guy, man. So his whole fucking life just sucked up and taken away. We got a mission with Michael. We could start. Let's uh, let's go and see what's good over there. That was a bit rough, though. I ain't gonna lie. Later, Dave. That was really rough. Let's go over though uh, to his house and uh, let's carry on. All that later, I hope. Alrighty, what is going down in the DeSanta household? Did somebody say yoga? Oh no. Oh no. Not yoga. Oh, fuck this. What is wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you turned into an even bigger asshole. Well, thank you. Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still, that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle him. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? <laughs> oh, no. No, I think she said whoremongering asswipe. I like that one, <laughs> darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yeah, she's very centered. A regular you oasis of peace and tranquility in this one. Anger issues and worse friends. No mm. wonder I'm so upset. You too. Please. Namaste. Namaste. 
We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, no. The yoga is for sharing. Come, come, Miguel, go. Awesome. <laughs> so, Fab, if you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it'll be a job well fucking done. We are all on our own journeys, Miguel. Yeah, no doubt. So why is she driving a tank on hers? <laughs> Breathe, Mikkel. to deal with your hostility, Michael. Now here is good. We have the sun and the Murabunda. The what? The asshole. What? Now we begin and put the asshole to the earth. Uh -huh. Yes. We begin each sequence. Katasana. Yes. The asshole. Or mountain pose. All right. One. Two. Mouth and anus are perfectly in line. This guy freaks me the fuck out. Um, it is perfect. Now, Mikel. Mikel. Come on, Mikel. I don't know about this. Come on, Mikel. We can do this. Out through the nose and out the mouth. Let it out. Let's it out, Mikel. Pretend there's a cigar in your mouth. <sighs> that is okay. okay. In the nose, out the mouth. Okay, Doc? Okay, Doc. Here is out, please. There. Strong. Like an erection of your youth. Huh? What? Now, in through the bloated nose and out through those wrinkled lips. <laughs> Feel all that hostility, insecurity, and self-centeredness drift away. This is gonna have to do. Now we will do something more complicated. Sometimes, when I do this pose, I weep uncontrollably for hours. Um. What? Um. Feel that the emotion inside. Let it go. <laughs> Michael, <laughs> he's all what? <laughs> I feel like I'm channeling bullshit right now. <laughs> Breathe, Mikael. Come on, Mikael. You can do this. Out through those wrinkled lips. Erect, turgid. Hold it. Stroke it. Now, what? you breathe. I'm waiting for him to turn this into one of his episodes. Out through you can those breathe, wicked lips. Can't you? Out through the mouth. He's actually trying. I can't believe it. Come on, Mikel. You can do this. The silly man forgets to breathe. How many years of marriage, and this is the first time he's taken an interest in my hobbies? Yeah, I'm about to feel some emotions, all right. Remember, children, do not fear the unknown. We are the unknown. Show Whatever that means. I don't think Michael's up to this. Hmm. He may surprise you. Huh? Plank. Plank. Chataranga. Chataranga. Yeah. Feel the flow. Mm. Everything is flowing in me. Oh. Um. Mike, would you? Uh, I guess. What the fuck? No, I. I hope there is time for yoga to save you. Exhale. If you'd found yoga before, you wouldn't have been that way with Coach. Wait, what? Are you fucking for real? Stupid ass bitch. So. Take in the air and release it. Let it out, baby. Hold the anus. The anus. Please, please, Michael. Not bad. Your lungs, they work, yes? 
Yes, they do. Just exhale, Michael. No vanity. Come on. Probably good or what? Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Yes, very important. The backward eye between your thigh. What? Take in the air and release it. Very good. Now let it go. <sighs> you have come a long way today, Mikael. Huh? Yes, later you will cry like a baby. <laughs> what? His chakras are completely blocked. Don't worry about him. Show me the downward dog. <laughs> what? I'm glad we have helped with your impotence, Mikael. What'd you say? Your sexual energies have been blocked for too long. Hey! Back into my pelvis. Back. What? Back, back. Yes, there. Oh, huh? oh, 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 hey, enough of that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yoga is the answer, Mikhail. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving and we are never coming back. Good. You are alone, you pathetic psychopath. Uh, fuck you. And that phony French fucking yogi. <laughs> Oh man. Well, that could have gone better. Go to Jimmy's room. Okay. Jimmy, we're a bit, we're a bit wet. You but... still here? James. Oh shit! This way. Be alone. Hey. Oh, yeah. Fuck you. You know what? If there was a rape button, I'd be using it right now. The Unless... fuck. Nice TV. Did I pay for that? Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? Right, come on, I want to go for a ride. I gotta meet a friend. Alright, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I wanna get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. This is fucking bullshit. This guy, bullshit. man. Bullshit. Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies. They're the only okay. people you speak to. Alrighty, for today's video, boys, gonna end it here. Thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed it, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you for more GTA next time. Still, some guys have a great one. See you again in the next video.